Hi, my name is McKenna and I'm here with Audra O'Neill, the Greatwood Real Estate Agent. How are you today? I'm good, how are you? Good, so I hear you're the Greatwood girl. Well, that's what they call me. Um, I am happy to take that title. I do love this neighborhood. How long have you lived in Greatwood? I've lived in Greatwood for 22 years. Mike and I actually moved out here before we got married. Shh, don't tell anyone that. And um, before we had kids. So we bought a house. Matter of fact, a lot of people thought after we started having children that I was the nanny when I would take them down the street, um, which was pretty funny. <laughs> so. <laughs> so what made you become the Greatwood Real Estate Agent? Well, I started, we went back to real estate in around 2010. And when we did, um, I loved where I lived. I loved raising my children here in this neighborhood and I loved real estate. So I wanted to combine the two worlds. So I decided to start a campaign and really learn the neighborhood. I learned every section, they were still building out. I learned what price points you know, were going on in there. And like myself, I moved from a small house to a bigger house as my family started to grow. And other people did too. Nobody wanted to leave. Everybody wanted just to stay in the neighborhood. They wanted to keep their dry cleaner, keep their friends and keep their schools, just like I did. So I saw a trend and I said, okay, well, I think I'm just gonna talk to people about doing that and move them around in the neighborhood. The most we've ever moved one person is nine times. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah. So she's owned nine houses in Greatwood. Lots of different things going on in her life. But people were like, okay, I want to buy a pool, or I want to upsize, or I want to downsize, or whatever's going on in their life. So that's kind of what made me really focus on where I lived to be able to sell homes here, um, you know, because I got to live here too. Do you know how many listings you've sold in Greatwood? Oh, my gosh. Uh, no. I mean, probably well over 150 or so. You have actually sold 236. Wow, just listings? Just listings. Okay, all right, cool. Do you know how many buyers you've helped find a home? No, let's see, probably over 100 also, yeah? 147. Wow, okay. I remember all of those. I love buyers, especially the first time home buyers. They're my absolute favorite. So <clears throat> with 236 listings, 147 buyers, you have sold 44 off-market properties. Oh, wow. Just in Greatwood? Just in Greatwood. Wow. With a grand total of 427 since 2013. Since 2013. Wow. You know, I've never sat down and added up the numbers. I, I mean, I can name the people. It's crazy how you can drive down the street and you see a kid that you've never met, but you know who, who they belong to because they look just like their parents. <laughs> That's always like, I'm like, oh, I sold him a house. He looks just like his daddy. <laughs> so, but yeah, that's exciting. So what's next for Greatwood? What's next for Greatwood? Well, the location is imperative. With all the growth going up and down 99, and as soon as they complete that third circle, which hopefully is in our lifetime, it will only make our location even better than it is right now. People in Greatwood, you know, Mike and I have always said, okay, every single year we're gonna update one thing on our house. We're gonna do floors one year. We're gonna do paint another year. We put in the pool one year. We put in the patio another year. Finally, our kitchen. The next one is our master bathroom. So nobody's allowed in there just yet. Um, but the neighborhood always seems to keep up its value because everyone does that. Everyone does a little bit to their house every single year to keep them going. They're getting older. They need love. They need attention. And as long as people keep doing that and young families keep moving in, Greatwood is going to be as good as it has been for new families over and over and over.